the Santa Monica Museum of Art presented its sixth annual cultural bike tour, Tour de Arts Volume 6, on a sunny Sunday afternoon. We had a blast exploring the creative side of bicycle culture on a casual nine-mile ride filled with art, music, and theater. A free day of art, culture, and fun for kids and families. The Santa Monica Museum of Art attracted about 300 of those in the community who love art and who love to bike, giving new meaning to being pumped up. So people are stopping by to make sure they got enough air, that their brakes are working, that they're able to shift gears. And go to some really great art events all around Santa Monica and learn about bike advocacy and safety and um, about art. For those who didn't have a bike of their own, not to worry, complimentary bike rentals were available from Perry's Cafe and Rentals. We've supplied 35 bikes for the ride today, and um, you had to sign up for them online. We've got a few extras in case, you know, for the, the ones who didn't sign up. This is my first time out, so we're having a, a tour of the art district here for Santa Monica. And yeah, are you excited? Yeah. On this stop, Robert Swain takes us on a journey of color that changes the way you see the world. Ready? A chromatically radiant exhibition of paintings, a full five-hour afternoon where riders were dazzled by unique sights and sounds at three different stops. A music and movement concert by artist-musician Anna Oxygen at the Santa Monica Bay Women's Club and an animated film with live shadow choreography at Barnum Hall gave us all a chance to stretch it out and shake it off. Learning how to ride the streets, uh, explore their city's cultural resources, the beautiful historic venues like the Santa Monica Bay Women's Club, and we're going to go to Barnum Hall, which is also a historic theater, and uh, they'll learn all, learning by doing, by pedaling around and seeing their city in a different way if they don't usually do that. Riders experience Santa Monica as a car-free community, learning about the city's bike lanes and other bike-friendly infrastructure from Tour de Arts ride leaders. You know, we're really pumping out the fact that the, the new three-foot passing law is coming into effect September 16th, so requiring motorists to allow at least three-foot clearance when they pass a bicyclist on the street. We have music, art, fun, and just encouraging people to get out there and ride and experience their city on a bike. So whether you get here by bike or by car or soon by light rail, make sure to come down to the Santa Monica Museum of Art. Reporting for Santa Monica Update, I'm Tamara Henry. The current exhibit at the museum is Citizen Culture, Artists and Architects Shape Policy. The exhibition explores the intersection of art and politics. It runs through December 13th. For more information, go to smmoa.org.